Hey everyone, Chris Remis from Coal Banker here in Boston. Welcome back to the latest version of my video blog. Today I wanted to talk to you about listing in the fall market. So we've been going through the pandemic now for a good six months or so, and it's really uh, starting to have an effect on the market in good ways and in bad ways. So first of all, it's very important to know that people's housing needs have changed. So we need to take that into consideration. So a lot of people are looking to list their house in the fall and people call me and say, Chris, what do I need to think about? So there's three things that you need to think about when you're listing your house during the pandemic. And it's really all about going back to basics. People have a lot of time, they're home, they're on their computer, and they're trying to find agents online. I think that's probably not the best way. We always tell people you wanna ask your friends, family, your neighbors for, for real estate agent referrals. And if that doesn't work, you can always call me. Even if that does work, you can always call me. I'm happy to vet somebody. I have a great network of people and I'll find you a great agent. I just did that last week uh, for a dear friend of mine. So finding a good agent is the first thing that you're gonna wanna do before you put your house on the market or as soon as you start thinking about putting your house on the market. The second thing you're gonna wanna do with your agent is you're gonna wanna stage your house properly because like I said, people's housing needs have changed and the way that people are living has changed. People's houses are not just their homes anymore, they're also their offices and they're also their schools. So we wanna make accommodations for that to help buyers see that they can uh, live in their house the way they want to. Something else that uh, I like to talk to people about is uh, that the rental market, we're seeing an uptick in vacancies in the rental market, and that's creating a lot of opportunities for people, particularly if you wanted to uh, make investments, or if in Boston it happens to be that you're a parent and you're uh, ha sending the kids to school, it might be something to think about to uh, you know, buy a place uh, to park your kid for three or four years, uh, and it's a great investment opportunity. Uh, also, something else I tell people is that uh, one reason that people are selling these days is because their second homes are really become their primary homes and they don't need their primary homes for a while because they're going to be working from home. So, uh, so something else to think about. But then the last thing you want to do, as with always, we always want to uh, price our property right. You find a good agent. We're going to go through the market. You're going to go through the comps. You want to know the comps. The agent's going to know the comps. You want to price it right the first time because uh, during the pandemic, after about the first week, the listing becomes stale. So you really want to get an offer on the door as quickly as possible. Things are hot. Things move quickly. Uh, and that's, uh, that's really what you want to do. You always want to price it right. Anyway, I hope this was helpful for you. Uh, feel free to reach out if you have any questions about buying or selling this fall. 617-947-9337. Thanks, everybody. Bye-bye.